Hey buds, welcome back to Madables and welcome back to Madables without blue hair and DBZA. Let's get into it. Hey, how's it going? Check out this thing. Greatly appreciate it. I I may do it. I'm, I'm still a little skeptical because, uh, you know, I'm still not in the place where I can just content creation for full time because uh, I still am po possibly looking for jobs in a very random field, which I guess maybe we'll talk about in the future. Um, so I don't know if that would hurt or not, but I'm going to wait just in case. All right, and if things go well on YouTube, sure, I'll do that. I'll make a sub goal or whatever they call it on YouTube, and we'll we'll celebrate with me looking like Trunks, or anybody else. <laughs> Actually, no, it was James, I think, not Trunks. I don't know. There's a lot of characters I want to cosplay and look like. Anyway, I'm ranting. Following is a fan base parody. Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Z, and Dragon Ball GT, all owned by Funimation, Toei Animation, Fuji TV, and Akira Toriyama. Please support the official release. Wait, so you're saying he had a sub lab? Of course he had a sub lab. We all have sub labs. Where do you think I keep your mother's clothes? Mom's what? Don't go in the basement. <laughs> oh look, there's bombs in the android. <laughs> this is my kind of guy. <laughs> this is my kind of guy. Oh my god. It's like right on the urge of like not being a piece of shit, but like you're still you're still sketchy. It, that, like you're not supposed to do that, but that's it's not a bad idea for people that are in that law lawless nature huh i'm just saying you know he could have cloned a bunch of different women but he cloned the women he loved the most so his heart's there but he also cloned her so there's also that <laughs> there's, there's lots of layers to that right, so i could probably make a detonator for that i don't know do you really have to blow them up why do you care they're mostly just machinery at this point Oops, except for the lady. Baby maker's still intact. Guess she's still useful for something. So you're saying she still has a- Vagina, yes. Just went from a nine to a ten. <laughs> anyway, where's everyone else right now? Well, Piccolo and the others are searching for Cell. How are all these rides still running? Why are the clothes still on them? This is supposed to be a place of fun! <laughs> so hopefully that's going well. And Trunks went off to find Vegeta. Is it that hard to find Cell? You know, like, I feel like his power must be growing exponentially at this point with all the sucking he's been doing. So I feel like if they can't sense it, they just got to follow the trail of clothes and they can all fly and, tell, and go really fast. We, we can't be up that far behind. Notice me! <laughs> no! Best of luck there. And any update on Goku? Oh, he's just resting at Kame House. Probably still asleep. Goku's awake and Moses has brought the Jews. By the way, my pantry's not full enough. Hmm? Goku! <laughs> oh, hi. Aw, <laughs> uh, hugs are nice. Oh, tell me you're finally- Does he not love his family? You know? <laughs> because there's only so much you can cut from Dragon Ball Z to the point where you make it seem like he doesn't care about his family, to the point where they didn't animate it. You know, am I missing out on something? Because I feel like he should be more happy for his son and his, I was gonna say his mother and his wife. Are you okay? Yeah, huh? Never felt better. Wanna see? Hold on. Huh. <laughs> Wonder when she'll come back down. I can't believe you took this thing off-roading! This thing barely handled on the freeway! Oh, come on, 18. Where's your it. sense of adventure? About 15 miles back with the shocks! I personally enjoy this alternate route. It is dense with foliage and wildlife and... <laughs> Hmm. 
and spending time with you, but clearly you disagree. Won't lie, <laughs> sis. Kind of a dick move. Oh, come on. We'll take him. I love him. I love him. He's. They really like do great work with the with the villains in this uh, in the show because like they they come. I don't know if it's just because they're here for a short time usually, but they come in and they hit you with their like charming little quirky self, and then they die. You know, and I I feel like maybe I just don't respect the good guys enough because they don't die enough to be, to miss them. <sighs> I'm just I'm still heartbroken over Napa. I want more Napa. Into a zoo after this. How's that? You want to hit up the zoo, 16? I want to see the parrots. Goku, you have missed a hell of a day! Oh, I know everything. I learned it in my pirate dream. I was having a ninja dream too, but it ended. Alright, now oh, listen. Yeah, right. I know you just woke up, so... <laughs> yeah, I was out of permission for a while. I really ought to get back to training. <sighs> so I can fight Cell. <sighs> what? If, if you're worried about Gohan, I'll bring him along with me. <sighs> Fine. Huh? Go ahead! Go train! Take Gohan! Fight your evil android bug monster! But I want you to promise me one thing. Okay... What's that? I want another baby! Hmm. Hmm. Okay, bye! <laughs> was that a yes? It wasn't a no! Hmm. I feel like she's gonna get what she wants regardless. You know? Chi Chi's not- I feel like she's not the one to accept a no regard- anyway. I think she would be the person to do it while he's sleeping. I'm actually surprised she didn't do it while he was unconscious or in a coma or anything. Or while he was in pain from a heart attack. I mean, I guess she is a, a caring wife, but like... She, she gets what she wants. Hmm. Okay, bye! <laughs> Thanks for swinging by to pick me up! What were you doing at Bulma's house anyway? Oh, just dropping off the blue Gina. I mean, bad Prince. I mean, thanks for swinging by to pick me up. This is bad. We can't keep running after Cell. Every time he slips away, we lose another city. Don't be so melodramatic. Worst case scenario, we wish people back with the Dragon Balls. Uh. uh... Oh God, what? So remember how Kami and I fused? No. And remember how we used to have Dragon Balls? Holy shit. Wait, I'm still confused. The Dragon Balls don't exist anymore, Krillin. I didn't think about that. I didn't think about that. Dude, don't worry. I still have the bunker. What do we have, Goku? I'm taking Gohan. Bye. What? <laughs> good news. We have Goku. Bitchin, let's go hang at Kame House. Oh, good. We'll have to see if he's carrying. Carrying what? I'm asking if he's got any grass on that island. Well, yeah, but it's mostly covered by that house. He's asking if he has any pot. I don't know, probably. I mean, he knows the Mafuba. Oh my god. The what? <laughs> huh? What just happened? Goku, had it go on? I'll fill you in later, Gohan. Hey, Trunks! How's the training coming? I don't know, let's see. Hey, Dad, do you want to train with me? F*** off! How about that, well. <laughs> Ooh, only on two words, huh? I'll go talk to him. Only on two words. That's a beautiful way to describe your relationship with Vegeta. Hey, Jeets. <laughs> I heard you lost your fight pretty bad. <laughs> but you know what they say, Vegeta. When you fall off that horse, you get right back up, and you eat that horse. Come eat that horse with me, Vegeta. What the hell are you on about? Oh, I just found a place where we can do a whole year's worth of training in a day. I'm listening. It's up on Kami's lookout. Although now I guess it's just the lookout. Either way, they call it the hyperbolic time chamber. What the f is that? So 18, what's I like I knew about the hyperbolic time chamber. I just didn't know what it did. I always confused it with like that ship that Goku uh trained on on the way to uh freezer. You know. Uh, so I always just confused the two. I didn't know it was a whole separate location, so this is cool. I get to learn more. What's it look like in there? It looks like Goku's wife is a Chinese princess. Seriously, I'm glad she's my size, but who wears this junk? I mean, is Goku there? 
Oh no, place is empty. Devoid of both people and taste. Actually, this is a random thing. I feel like if you're cyborgs and if you're making cyborgs and you're like creating cyborgs, I feel like I would give them, it wouldn't be tele, like telepathy, 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 tele, 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 yeah, I would put walkies in their head so they can communicate back and forth, right? Without having to actually talk out loud because then it can kind of plan a little bit easier and be a little bit more sneaky with things, right? You know, if you're making robots and you have this kind of technology, make them be able to communicate in their head. Unless they are doing that and I'm just not registering, but I'm pretty sure their mouths are moving. Huh. Yeah. Didn't figure Goku for a runner. Well, if I were a guessing girl, I'd say they're a Kane house. But that's like the second place we'd look. Confirmed. That is the second place we shall look. Hmm. But it's on an island, so we can't take a van. Oh, thank God. So we'll find a boat. No. Pardon? We have done it your way. Now we do it my way. The bird way. We fly. He's finally speaking my language. I mean, kind of. We fly. Here it is, maggots, the hyperbolic time chamber. Wait, I thought it was called the room of spirit and time. I said that because you kept mispronouncing it. Well, I can do it. Hypebola mind chamber. No. Hyperglycemic crime chamber. You get one more. Hypebonics rind chamber. <laughs> hmm. Inside, time moves at 365.24 times that of this dimension. Point two. In Goku terms, one day out here, one year in there. And only two of you maggots can enter at a time. Why is that the, like, the rule? And also, do they age faster in this hyperbolic time chamber? Hypey boo like bob boom boom Bobby bb bop bop. Um, you know, because if time moves faster in there, then they technically should age in there, right? Because that's it, that's it's kind of like uh, not Inception, Interstellar, <laughs> right? Isn't isn't that kind of the idea? And then if that is also true, I would put Goku and Vegeta in first, and when they come out, I put Gohan and Trunks in there for like a week, seven years. Gohan will come out of there yoked out of his mind. Wait, how long have you known about this? Since I was a kid. Also, can you stop it at any moment? And would you just enter in like, if you exit like halfway through, it would be six months. So like, how do you eat in there? Do you bring snacks in there? Do they like just come out like every like 30 seconds for dinner? Y you know? I, I like these uh, little ideas there. Then why didn't Krillin and the others use it to train against the Saiyans? Th why didn't we use it to train against the androids? They had other training. Besides, they most likely would not have survived. I threw Goku in there once when he was a kid. I almost died. Hmm. Then the boy and I will go first and save you two the trouble. Move it, boy! Help me. Have fun, Trunks. You too, best buddy. That's nuts. Huh. You know? So the second he closed that door, it's already been like two or three weeks in there, right? Well, I guess it would be 52 weeks total in one day. So I guess it wouldn't be two. It, it'd probably be like a few days the second he closed that door, which is still just as crazy, right? I love the idea of it. I love the science behind it. I want to I wanna know more. I'm excited for the comments on this one. Oh, you don't really seem like yourself today, Mr. Popo. Hmm. Make sure you let the right one in, or you'll be dead Not by today. Dawn. The death toll keeps rising as the unknown creature continues its terrifying siege across our nation. I get it, he's absorbing people! I'm trying to stop it! Yeah, the, the news should be able to cover this. You know, if people if, if cities are being vanquished, that like the news would be able to cover where he is currently. Especially if he's a major city, they should be announcing like evacuation, beep, 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 you know, and, you know, they would be like, huh, I hear that because I have super person hearing or like, oh, I have the radio on or like, D oh, wait, are they even associated with like the military or like the police? Aren't they like technically superheroes or are they like, undercover superheroes? But like, they're also protecting Earth a lot. So like they should be on some kind of phone call, like the Powerpuff Girls or something, right? <laughs> right. 
Maybe you should get some sleep like everyone else. Probably. I'll sleep when I'm dead! I can help with that. <sighs> Wake up! Ah! Oh, man! I had the craziest dream! Cell was there! Well, the androids are here! Yo. Ah! Yo. We're here for Goku. Son of a bitch. Son Goku is not here. Son of a bitch. You heard him. Goku's not here. Oh, I heard him. We're just not very happy about it. Right, 16? Son Goku is not here. Exactly. And we came all the way out here to kill somebody. So you've got one of two choices. You can either tell us where Goku is, or, well... Or what? Or we kill you. Oh my god. Hey, 18? You... you come around here often? Nope. Hmm. Excuse me, androids! If you're gonna fight, could you please move it off the island? It's quite literally the only thing I own. That's fine. But when I win, I'm blowing it up for funsies. Hmm. All right then, follow me. <laughs> There's a series of uninhabited islands over there. How do you know that? You three stay here. I'll handle this. Can you handle oh, this? Oh, Space Buculator! So, if he fails, we're all gonna die, right? Basically. And we have no Dragon Balls. I think it's good he just, like, took them away, you know? Because I'm like, you you have three allies there, and then we were talking about the comments that like, Krillin's actually pretty strong now. But also, he might not be still up to par with them anyway. So maybe it's like, Piccolo, you go waste their time in an undisclosed location, which was not undisclosed at all. I just felt like putting a word before a location. Um, and hold them on. And until I guess one day you know and then fly around and waste time and then they come out of there super jacked hope oh, training's going well uh, uh, holy this place it's nothing but a white void I can't see where it ends or even where it begins I have so many questions about it's this chamber overwhelming yeah I need time time to adjust time to training begins now <laughs> You weren't ready. I love it. Anything back? Anything at the end of this? Oh. Hmm. So. <laughs> Okay. All right. Great. Anyway, that, thank you for the thank you for watching this with me. I appreciate you guys being here. Uh, please answer any questions I have. I I like learning through you guys and all that jazz. Okay. See you later. Okay. Bye.